that couldn't figure out why scientists hadn't done this. Currently, we're inflating the balloon with sulfur dioxide, SO2. Which is one of the substances emitted by volcanoes, and this serves as our sunscreen for Earth. It reflects a little bit of sunlight from the stratosphere for two years before falling back to Earth. The idea that we might engineer what might be called the good part of the volcano has taken off and increasingly has found capital willing to fund it. It's a controversial idea that's recently been attracting billionaire philanthropists. And Make Sunsets is acting one balloon at a time for now. In California, we join them as they launch their sulfur-filled balloons. Come on, come on, come on, come on. It's going to hit. And when you apply the Silicon Valley ethos of move fast and break things, sometimes things break. Please stop filming. With the help of a metal pole and a ladder, the work continues. There you go, there you go, there you go. Oh, yeah, baby. <laughs> nice job. We don't know how much a dose cools the planet. We don't know if continued geoengineering will wreck weather patterns like monsoons or destroy opportunities for agriculture in different parts of the world. I politely disagree with scientists who think we need to have a, you know, 99.999% understanding of the exact amount of cooling because we don't have that for the warming created by CO2. We can't let precision be the enemy of action.